Now turning to the South Korean economy, production across all sectors fell last month due to lower demand for semiconductors and automobiles. That dealt a heavy blow to manufacturers. Oh Soo-young reports. It seems the Korean economy is still trying to get back on its feet. According to Statistics Korea on Friday, production across all industries dipped 0.4% from the previous month, with industrial output in particular dragging down overall performance. The industrial output of mining and manufacturing firms nosedived 3.4%, the biggest monthly drop since the global financial crisis. Much of the fall was triggered by a decrease in semiconductors and automobile production, with chip output plunging 11.5%. The economy is still on the mend from a particularly rough period, so the recent setback in manufacturing can be seen as a base effect. But with the political instabilities expected to simmer down, with the next administration expected to produce its key policies in the latter half of the year, an improvement in production and investment can be expected. It seems consumption is also in the process of steadying. Retail sales recovered in January, rising for the first time in four months. Demand for cars, clothing and cosmetics helped push the figure up by 3.2 percent from January. But economists say this isn't a cause for much excitement. The uptick is also most likely due to the base effect, so we need to wait and see if the following months will bring around a true rise in consumption. The upcoming presidential election could help, becoming a seasonal factor, but down the road, lingering structural problems in Korean society, instability regarding jobs, housing and household debt, would need to be addressed in order to boost consumer sentiment. Looking ahead, The Economist said production in Korea has a good chance of improving this year, as exports could rise on the back of a more robust global economy. However, he also said the rise of protectionism, China's unofficial trade barriers against Korean businesses, or an unexpected jump in the local currency are factors to watch out for. Oh Young, Arirang News.